So they buffed this guy, Praline, Wind, Madeline, Cookie, same exact unit in the last bounce patch. Now he has a 19% speed lead. He does so much in one kit. Usually you have to have a speed lead plus an attack power booster plus an attack gauge booster. He has a speed lead. He has attack gauge boost. He has attack power boost. He has crit rate boost. That is a lot. If this unit was out in Summoner's War at the very beginning, he would have been triple S tier nat 4 for sure. No question is asked, because we were bringing in Tyron, we were bringing in Bernard, we were bringing in Seek. Now this unit does all three of those. It is not exactly the same as all three of those combined, but for the most part, he does all three of those things skills. It's ridiculous. We're going to play around with him today. We're on the Asia server account, which means we also have a fun little LD5 we're going to play with as well. So... Should be a fun day. So I was testing this out last night. This is the next day, by the way. I wanted to see what we could hit with this, what we couldn't hit with this. I feel fairly confident-ish that this Kabila can outspeed some things. Some 33 speed leads, like for example, their Bastet. Let's let's see if that's true. The the issue is if uh, Eludia does too much damage, some of can come back from the dead and start uh, killing things. And yeah, that's we might see this here. Okay. Oh. This is okay. So this is bad, but on the bright side, I I I think we oh we don't lose because Summoner's War has terrible AI. This should have gone very differently. This should have gone very differently. This might be a tall order trying to get this to outspeed a Bernard and 33. It's the 33 speed. Oh, never mind. It's the 33 speed lead that's uh, the issue, not the Bernard base speed, because we have better base speed than he does. We have Will Row. I, I put Will Runes on. In the, in between this and the last one, I put I put Will Runes on. So we don't have to worry about that issue, but we're doing enough damage to actually kill these uh, Samas before the thing that prevents the revive kills it. This is interesting. We don't have to... As long as we kill with the Linda, we don't have to worry about the revives. Feels like we should be killing with the Linda in this instance, though. Because things are not... I'm going to say... Okay, there we go. And maybe we should try going for... The nice thing about this is there's always fire threats on defense. And Praline, we haven't built kind of tanky. So we don't have to worry... Too, let's just hit this thing. We don't have to worry too much about the um, the squishy light units getting attacked. Because something like Perna, as you can see, is attacking the, uh, the, the tanky wind unit. It's hard to try to tap on things and talk at the same time if you couldn't already tell. <laughs> I have limited brain functionality and I can't do both. We could definitely hit this one. I feel very confident that we're going to. If if their Tiana is over 330, they deserve to win. I'm not even going to... I'm not going to argue. I'm, I'm going to be more impressed by anything. I'm going to be like, how... That is, she is not very high base speed. That is impressive. So... If I'm going to lose, I want to lose to someone uh, hustling more than I do. Dangerous taking it into this. This is not really a great defense, but... Uh, you can hit this with other teams is, is what I mean. So, because they don't have anything. They have a speed lead, but they don't have anything on Swift. The bell is definitely going to proc, yeah. He's going to do his thing. So, let's see. If Rakan moves next, he does not. So, we can at least do this. And he has the block beneficial effects, which means he's not nearly as scary. And I will take it. And now it's going to be 25 minutes of Abelio trying to solo, and maybe he wins. Well, actually, we have a heal block with this Praline, too. Usually, it doesn't really matter too much, but in some instances like this, that could be nice. I feel like we're going to outspeed, but Abelio is definitely going to cut in. So, let's see how this plays out. We could lose this one. Yep. We do Well, actually, we don't... Oh, my goodness. We don't have to worry about the Clara because she was stunned. This is one of those situations where sometimes it's nicer to have Gemini than Eludia because Gemini's not going to do so much damage to Abelio. But also on the flip side is Gemini's not going to do so much damage. So following up with Linda might not actually kill things. There's pros and cons. 
We should put him on a damage build. I think it's just on speed HP HP or something. Like that. Different team, but still using Praline. I I think Praline's gonna be the thing that we put on the thumbnail. I don't know. We're just we're just playing the game, guys. <laughs> we're just playing the game. Just whatever matches. I'm like, ah, eh, let's let's uh. <clears throat> nice. Actually, we should have gone. I suppose it's fine. I was gonna say we should have gone skill two, but. Let's see, we might be able to take this uh, Nana down and then, yeah, just get soloed by Riley over the next five minutes. So this one's nice for several reasons. We have two things that are going to revive, but Linda is going to stop things from reviving. We can outspeed since we have Kabila here. And also, against the Laika, it's going to be pretty decent. So, let's see the beautiful power of Linda. We have nothing to- look how beautiful that was. Here's another one I feel confident enough because this is Kabila that we're using. By the way, I built- I built Kabila and I built Praline just for this video. We had, of course, Eludia built uh, since we got it like a week or two ago or whatever. Because um, we actually got it before we did the video. I was <laughs> working on- uh, working on fusing so many Sigmars in the meantime. So, yeah. Beautiful, but that 330 speed Kabila, I'm I'm confident enough taking it in with the Praline speed lead um, and the double boosters because Kabila and Praline both boost against 33s and Clara's. 33 Triton is dangerous, but 33 Clara, I feel confident enough. This is dangerous. So there's so many reasons this could go wrong. Number one, we could get interrupted by the Volantis. Number two, we could get outsped since this is 113 base speed now. We have 120 plus. Uh, 210 over here. I don't know if I showed you guys the runes on this. It's not the most amazing. It just is Kabila, so That's why we have a chance. Maybe we have a chance. Maybe we don't. Let's see. We do not But the AI in this game is uh Well, yeah, the AI in this game is the AI in this game. Let's do skill three We did not uh, we did not land it. Okay, the revenge Let's see Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll I'll take it. We could still lose, but let's do a defense break. Let's see if we get a stun here. This could be a nice spotlight of what his second skill can do. Yep, there we go. That was actually uh, beneficial. Thirty-three plus Clara. By the way, Clara has a speed lead too. Just in case we guys are uh, coming back to the game, um, we might have an issue with Kinky soloing us, but. I, I feel like we have a decent chance to outspeed against these 33 Claras. Alright. And then one of these. And at least we will... Uh, I was hoping we were going to get some other debuffs on the uh, on the Kinky. He's going to AoE. He's, no, he's not going to AoE. Let's see if we can stun him. Yeah, they're beautiful. That's exactly what we needed. But yeah, it's it's uh it's better generally to take cockies into kinky defenses. I'm gonna call this person's bluff. They have two units that are potentially on swift. They have Bastet, they have Triton. Is one of them going to be on swift and one of them gonna be on despair? I I'm Okay. Triton was definitely faster than Bastet. Bastet wasn't even at max uh, attack gauge. Let's see. He does cut, but we do have immunity, and AI in this game is terrible. So can we kill? There we go. Ooh, this can be dangerous. Can we kill here? Very nice. Would have been better if we had more additional damage in artifacts, but that's the uh, Kabil's actually not bad with additional damage because she's got multi hits on skill one, she's got multi hits on skill two. This could go badly. A lot of these could go badly. Some of these we're getting kind of lucky on. Well, let's see. I'm hoping we defense break, but do not stun this uh, Dark Onimusha. Okay, that's that's good enough. Ooh. And we got lucky. We got lucky. I guess we'll do this on... It's not the same team, but we're not really showcasing Linda. This is not supposed to be a Linda video. So. So it's fine that we don't use the same team. Because we're, we're supposed to be showing Praline. That's the whole, that's the whole point. Alright. 
The rest of everything. The rest of everything is uh, pay to win units, even though we didn't pay to win for them. But there's a lot of defenses I'm seeing today that are like this. I don't think we can hit it with this. We're going to test it out. We're going to see if that theory is correct, but I'm pretty sure we're not going to be able to uh, manage this one. Mostly for Camila. Oh, you know, maybe, maybe this is fine. Maybe this is fine. I'm just seeing a lot of these defenses today. And I'm like, I don't know if we can manage that. Maybe this one just didn't have crazy runes. This, this is probably, it's <laughs> probably what it is. Yeah, this Camille is uh, definitely starting to become an issue for us. Maybe this will be enough. Nope. There we go. Additional damage artifacts. So you guys know this is not a great defense. It's just a shiny defense. We can hit this with so many different things, though. Let's see. Let's see. let's watch some crazy nonsense happen and we fail this miserably. Yeah, not a, not a great defense, though. This one, you know the Clara is going to be on Swift, right? But it's not a crazy speed lead. We can definitely outspeed with Kabila. No issues. The issue is going to be... Does First off, do we get cut? Second off, does... Uh, kinky solo. If we do get cut, they may not do the skill three. Okay, we don't get cut. We do have to. Goodness. We do. <laughs> we do have to uh, farm some more R five because some of these are missing, uh, missing grinds and missing efficiency on this Linda though. Not, not skill. You could. I mean, you could Lucian this. We have what? What other? Uh, what other teams do we have? We could do this if we wanted to. Would have been. Would have been. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> That's bad foreshadowing. It, this, that would have been much, uh, much better. That would have been a better comp though to use, and just nuke everything. Not even have to worry about the RNG. If maybe we land things, maybe we don't land things. So, let's. Oh my goodness. Hold on. Not, not what I was expecting to happen. I gotta say. Not expecting the uh, nemesis on Amusha. So let's let's see if we can handle this with Praline or or just Kabila. We can definitely hit this one. Again, I'm just trying to steer clear of Triton because I don't think we can outspeed Tritons here, unless there's like a um, a lesser sp ooh a lesser speed lead. I think we're just screwed now because we didn't we didn't land anything. Let's see if we can hit. Yeah, perfect. Okay, so that works to our advantage. It's not completely over, but wasn't the greatest. <laughs> wasn't the greatest that we didn't actually land our. Let's try to get this. Just kidding. Let's do attack age absorb. <clears throat> not not attack age absorb, is what I meant. Oh, I'll come back, beast. Maybe we won't auto with the beast rider coming back. So we get stun. All right, now we auto. So Linda only stops revives if she kills with skill three. You think we should chance it? I th I think it's about fifty fifty. I don't know. I think it's about fifty fifty. <clears throat> well, the fifty went in their favor, but. One of the lovely things about Summoner's War AI is that it, no one bothered to do it. So, that sometimes works in our favor. That's why sometimes you can just hit these speed teams and be like, I have a, a shield will, and then the uh, the stripper doesn't do the strips. So, and then we still lose because Summoner's War. I think we're gonna land it on everything but Kaki. And then Kaki's gonna solo. That's what I'm. That's my prediction for this match. Oh, nice. We did not get the. <laughs> Kaki solo. <laughs> oh, I hate it when I predict correctly. Kaki solo. Let's see. solo yet. 
Skill 2 Kabila. Let's see if we get screwed by the Abelio. We should bring in some other teams so we don't have to worry about Abelio in a situation like this. Yeah. Clara might not do Skill 3. As we've seen because she does skill three guaranteed if she has full hp but if that's not the case yeah no do uh do that that actually works in our favor let's kill this let's see if we can stun this okay she's hitting the tanky unit so that's not bad but yeah let's go here and actually, let's uh, do this so they don't have. So they don't have. System Can we please kill these things? Jeez. This is going to be a Swift Clara, of course, but I'm sure we can outspeed these Swift Clara. I mean, if we can't, that seems pretty fast. But all we have to do is a little bit of damage to Clara, and then we don't really have to worry about the. We do have to worry about this, though. Can we stun? There's the stun. Very nice. There's the additional turn. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> Alright. And now we get sold by Molly. We do have heal blocks. I, I don't see them ever landing. Let's see. Let's see if any heal blocks land. Oh, defense, but that's good enough. I'll take that. That's better than a heal block. Surprisingly, we actually cracked the top 100 with that team, which I was not expecting. But it's midweek, so that's why, regardless, we're still C3 because we don't have at least 16... Thank you for the pop-ups. At least 1,600 points because uh, that would have uh, that would have gotten us to G2. So Also, it's midweek, so the defenses aren't as crazy as the end of the week. But anyway, that is Praline after the buff. Same thing as the win mad line. Solid unit, though. I know we use the... We use the Eludia. Not everyone, most people can't replicate that. But Gemini is another um, Gemini and also the Wind. Where is she? Where is she? Wind Cilia, Wind Mystic Witch. This is also another one. She does her uh, strips and defense breaks over here. And this is also good against Light Lich as well. So just some other options. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you as always in the next one.